Back here again, and there's no time like the presence of vlog, so yep, we're doing the Thursday vlog. Uh, <laughs> I should do a Thursday and Friday vlog, uh, do one all at the same time. Um, basically, uh, what's been going on is that uh, in the evenings, uh, basically until about uh, August 28th, there's church every night for uh, for it's not actually it's not supposed to be called the death of honey. Uh, because they don't call that in Greek, they call it chemesis. Chemesis uh, is actually known as sleeping. So this is the uh, this is the, the sort of the festival because we don't have. It's not really our, our view of death is not uh, actually macabre or you know a uh, something to be mourned, but rather something to be celebrated. So. Uh, we do have these uh, celebrations in the church, and we're here every night. And this is actually where you can learn your Greek and see how it's used and so on and so forth in these different services. And a lot of these services are very ancient; they're old services. They're 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 more than a thousand years old. So uh, reading them is this is sort of like seeing how something was done, living it for real, and in and, and sort of seeing how something was done way back when. And so this is sort of uh, where I am now. And as I said before. Uh, Basically, every year I go back to school uh, because the way my research goes, it's like being in school for the rest of your life. And I'm just going to adjust this here. There we go. Better uh, camera angle. Uh, and I've been able to fit uh, my whole desk, my whole office with everything I study onto my Android. Uh, uh, I've got everything I need. And with uh, the file explorer here, I've got uh, uh, a full notebook. Uh, I do the editing on here for the uh, the BTS vlogs. They're, they're all done on here. Uh, I've got uh, a nice little bookshelf on here. There's a 32 uh, gigabyte uh, uh, SD card in here. And in my bookcase, I have uh, stuff for chemistry, uh, computer science, uh, dictionaries, Greek, math, and physics. And uh, so those are the areas that I'm currently studying. I will be adding an electronics section to this now uh, under the physics uh, to go more into electronics, electrical engine, uh, and electronic engineering uh, to get that end sort of more squared away. Uh, I'll be doing work in computer science in terms of robotics and um, uh, what you call it, uh, cybernetics. I'm still working on that to bring, uh, uh, what's her new name, uh, Cyborg Alpha more to life. Uh, that's I'll be starting actually uh, in a couple months to work on the voice for Cyborg Alpha. Uh, I'll be doing uh, work in uh, Vocaloids. Uh, if you know uh, the Vocaloids, you go do a search on, on, on uh, YouTube for Vocaloids. This is where the computer sings. And uh, for me, this is the sort of the best avenue to sort of get into developing and designing uh, the voice for Cyborg Alpha is through this uh, Vocaloids uh, system. Uh, because it does deal with uh, a lot of the aspects that you need to understand in order to develop voice for the computer system. Uh, so that's where things are going, and so there's an enormous amount of things. So I, I also have my uh, my book, my bag here. My, I have uh, the bag just like 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 uh, most school kids have. I have my school bag here. It's got everything in there, including uh, snacks, uh, water. This is my MP4 player. As I said before, I'm slowly moving into um, uh, uh, IPTV, so I have a larger IPTV. I'll show you at my off other office where I'm not right now. It's a larger, uh, it's a 10 inch uh, 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 LCD screen that takes the uh, USB uh, chips and, 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 uh, uh, and an SD chip. That's where all the uh, shows are on. This is eight, it has an eight gig uh, SD chip in here. And this is sort of a very tiny little screen. So it's like those portable uh, TV systems you used to have. Uh, if that's kind of on there like that. I got all the shows. Uh, I've got a pair of, <laughs> you know, my Greek book in here. There's my Greek book. This is one of the Greek books I'm learning to, uh, to read. And a hairbrush. Tape measure. In case I need to do some work around here. Uh, I was also able to pick up. Uh, I was also able to pick up. It was pretty cool for just about five bucks. I got this nice little pen for the tablet. 
Uh, and I'm using it primarily to draw with. To do, uh, try, I'm going to try to eventually, I found a good drawing program on here. The goal is eventually to do an animation, but first you have to do uh, your sketching, then you have to do colors. So basically you're going through your, your, uh, your all the old stuff you used to do f from coloring pages into, uh, into um, full drawn art by itself and that way from there you move from there into animation anyways that's that's kind of the cool part that's sort of what i've been doing and the question is now is whether or not i should do a giveaway this is sort of one of the things going to be in the title is is, is is the question mark giveaway uh but the thing is i really don't have anything to give away uh most of the stuff i get is refurbished so i don't think anyone wants anything refurbished uh maybe uh if I've got some art or something like that, maybe I can give that away uh, if I do some digital art. Just let me know what you think. What what, what should be given away if, if if you guys would like some bit of art or something like that. Uh, so, anyways, uh, I'm going to think about that. And that's it for uh, this Thursday's vlog. Alright, take it easy.